Welcome to another pixelforlife.com video tutorial. In today's lesson we're going to learn how to take an image and make it into a postal stamp that you can place on your website. Now this is a picture of me doing a backflip off of a trapeze bar at the summer camp I went to this year and I decided to use it because it was kind of a cool picture. So to start we're going to go ahead and size this image um, and in this case I want it to be a smaller stamp image so I'm going to put the width at 200 and leave constrained proportions on and then we'll view the actual pixels which is so big I'm now going to go ahead and just create a new layer above it um, and duplicate this layer hide that background one because I'm gonna want uh, two of them just in case so no mistakes are made next part is pretty easy we're just gonna hold down shift go up here and then drag out a circle and then we're going to align it so that there's about half the circle left and then we're just gonna hit delete hold down shift go down to um, with the, your arrow key and just keep hitting delete and just like that one side is done now what I can do to make this simpler is go ahead and select the selection hit control T rotate it around the other way and go ahead and grab this image and invert the selection deleting that selection there and then I can rotate this back like so and delete half the image and then on the bottom half layer we gotta delete the other half like so so we have it on both sides we can then merge those layers together and we have the stamp effect on the bottom done and same thing happens for the top part like so and then on the bottom part as well start right here And this is just a quick way to do it. Um, there's there's other ways that are probably a little bit better, but I'm also into saving you guys time if possible. So with that done, we're gonna go ahead and drag this layer to the bottom. We'll just fill that with black. Go to image canvas size, just double it. And keep it on relative. fill that with black and now on our actual stamp I want to go ahead and put a stroke onto that make it white keep it at about two pixels I'll then drop a shadow hit OK and I actually want to change this black color to dark gray hit OK and with that dark gray color on there I can now uh, select my stamp image here and if I had several images that look like stamps I could rotate them around like so and kinda make like a collage all together with them so I hope you guys enjoyed this lesson it's just a quickie but um, it's a cool technique and easy to do so I hope you enjoyed it and check out pixelforlife.com for more subscribe to our YouTube channel and be sure to subscribe on our website as well for great offers uh, relating to Photoshop and other design things. So, see you guys around and be awesome.